Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. I am Boss Lady for you guys. I hope you're having an amazing day. I'm having a great day so far, guys. It is about 11, 15 a.m. Eastern Standard Time where I am. And we are about to get started with day two, y'all. Um, In the earlier part, like the five, six days, leading up to valentine's day i don't go out as early i don't make it as much of a hustle bustle um tomorrow um which is friday it'll start getting a little bit more intense as the days progress towards valentine's day it'll get a little bit more intense i hope y'all can hear me over gavin back there with his um tablet um but yeah as the days i got him as the days get more in um, closer to Valentine's Day, things are getting more intense. I'll get out more earlier. I'll bring out more inventory, okay? So we're headed to um, set up the day. It's me and my daughter. My son is on his way back from out of town. So as soon as he get here, he'll be here. And it's just me. Huh? You want it? Um, it's, it's just me and Sierra today. Sierra had to go out of town. She'll be back um, tonight. So tomorrow it'll be all of them. But today it's going to be me, Sierra, and Malik when he get in town. My mom's supposed to be coming to help, but she had some business she had to attend to. But um, we're getting on out here and making it do what it do, y'all. Um, I have to, um, I think I'm leaving, I'm going to leave my tent today. I was going to bring it. I went ahead and pulled it out. I have two red tents. If you've seen my old videos or been following me since last year, you know that I have two red tents and I have some pink tents as well. I wonder is that the pink tent or the red tent? What you think? It looks, the bag looks like it's faded out. I'm, I didn't open it up to see, but either way. The pink tent. The red tent is dark in it. I know the tent is itself, but that bag had been sitting back there behind the thing i thought it had just got on oh, that faded uh-huh yeah, well i'll see when i open it up yeah so um yeah so we headed to get um uh, set up we i'm gonna leave the tent today the temperature somebody just asked about the temperature right now it's 61 i think it's supposed to get like in you know, what the high 60s or low 70s maybe um yeah so the the temperature has been really really good thanks be unto god for these last couple of days and it's supposed to rain friday and sunday okay but we're going out regardless you know i didn't sow in the snow i didn't sold in the sleep and people still buy and i still have a sellout so we're not gonna let the rain stop us um if you've never sold in the rain um or don't quite know how to set your tent up for the rain um, there's some videos on that last year showing what we did with the for the rain and the um, wind. So, if you're new to vending on the streets or you're just new to my channel, look at some of my old videos. That's going to be your best solution. Um, so, we're going to just have to put the work, the things my husband and taught us, and make it do what it do. I'm sure it won't be like he is his setup, but we're going to make it do <laughs> what it do. So we are almost here at the um, setup. So I'll be back with some more clips, guys. All right.
tongue. You gotta talk louder. Say it again. Say it loud, Gavin. Say, get your money. Bye-bye. Okay, y'all. So here is our setup for today. Again, this is the simplified version. Today is Thursday, guys. And tomorrow, I'm honestly thinking about going to get a U-Haul tomorrow, which will be my first time getting a U-Haul. My husband has always suggested that we get one, but me just being cheap, I never did get one. But this year, I don't think I have a big choice but to get one um, because my help is limited, number one. And then number two, um, it's expected to rain, okay? It's expected to rain, so I think we are going to get a U-Haul for tomorrow. Probably start tomorrow for the rest of the weekend. I may keep it on until Tuesday. We'll see how things go with the U-Haul. But we are set up, guys. And I'm not able. I normally have all red tablecloths, but this one over here you will see is a gold tablecloth. We got damage stroll up on it, but um, I did gold because I have all of my baskets set up at home and they're set up under my red tablecloth so I was unable to get to all of my tablecloths without having to take all of those baskets off the table and I just don't have the manpower to do all of that today so we just made it do what we do what it do with the red tablecloth that we got and I just had to roll one over here to the side you know still looks good and still looks professional but my opinion I would rather have had um uh-huh. I won't end up with a second. Though. All right, so we got the red tablecloths, um, and we're just going to have the gold one at the end. But um, what I was saying was, to, so tomorrow, since we are getting the U-Haul, I probably will not bring out the tent. I'm not quite sure about that. We'll see because it's supposed to rain. I got to see in the forecast. It's supposed to rain all day or part of the day. We will see, guys. But anyway, we have our setup out here. Um, still, you know, just bringing little bit by little bit so that it don't be too crowded until I bring all of my tables out. Um, Saturday, it's not supposed to rain. So hopefully we can get all the tables out and maybe just have the U-Haul on standby for the... Um, just to keep the baskets on the inside um because i've been traveling them and my tell you ride my mom has a suv as well and she's been carrying them in hers but because um we don't want to have to keep going back and forth even though i live real close to my vending spot i don't want to have to keep going back and forth from place to place so yeah we're gonna make it do what it do guys but anyway we are out here slow sales are again are still slow um, which is expected, okay? I do this every year. It's like this every year, okay? So I'm not intimidated at all, and you shouldn't be either that the sales are slow. If you did a good job with your baskets, you didn't throw them together, you know you got a great presentation, you know you got a great price point, then there's nothing to worry about. People are just waiting until closer to Valentine's Day to shop, okay? A lot of people will probably celebrate the weekend, so you'll probably get a lot of more sales over the weekend. But um, especially when, um, especially closer, closer to Valentine's Day. So y'all just hang on in there and wait and see what the end is going to be, guys. I'm excited. Um, pushing through today, you know, missing my husband so, so much. Just missing him all together and especially with um, trying to set all this stuff up and all of this stuff. Yeah, I am definitely missing him today, his presence. his um, manual help okay it's hard to find good help but me and my daughter made it do what it do my mom has came to um help out where she can and um we're gonna get it done regardless we're gonna get these baskets sold and we're gonna get out here and do what we do as business owners guys so i hope you guys are having a great day 
as far as sales and even if you're not like i said it's to be expected until we get closer closer to valentine's day i normally don't like to have my items real close together like this because to me it makes it a little crowded and junky and my husband wants a biggie on um, not having a whole bunch of stuff piled up on the table so we just have a lot of tables and we will spread it out but being that i don't have but three tables and then i have this little small round table we really don't have a lot of options but to put it up there i don't want it to make it look like i don't have any items here um and as you can see let me see if i can zone in just a little bit as you see right there that brick house where that gray car and that gold um band is that's where my competition always sit guys so don't be afraid that you may have other people out here doing the same thing that your people are right here which is a hop skip and a jump from where i am but no worries guys y'all can see this wind has picked up quite a bit today so which is another reason why i want to get the um view haul is because of the wind when my husband was here him to be fight the wind that was one thing but now i have to fight it by myself so yeah we're probably going to get a u haul for tomorrow and just decorate the u haul with balloons and stuff like that guys. so all right that's what it is and i'll see you guys on another clip Send it back with my grandma. Mommy. Mommy. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I know it, babe. I do too. <laughs> 